Hi everyone and welcome to this video and if you're new, welcome to my channel. Are you interested and excited to see what's hiding in October's glossy box? If you are, then please keep on watching. And I haven't seen any sneak peek or reviewed any video or watched any videos with glossy box unboxing, uh, unboxing because I didn't want to spoil the surprise. So this is how the box looks. Let me see the magazine and the box is the regular pink color. Let's take it out and open it together. I have no idea what's in here. It's heavy. I hope it's no I hope it's not another shower gel or shower cream. But it's a it's heavy. There is the card. Something smells. I think there is something for shower. So, let's see what do we have in here. The the biggest thing here is the moisturizing cream from Cetaphil. This is intense moisturizer for long-lasting hydration, fragrance-free body for body dry or sensitive skin. This is a body cream. I've tried the face products from Cetaphil and it doesn't really suit my skin. I don't know why it kind of makes me feel more dry and itchy and I don't really like how products work on my face. But I haven't tried anything for the skin and I'm kind of curious to try it. Let's open and smell it. I do not like smell the smell. It smells like other Cetaphil products, but let's try it just a little bit on the hand. There is my phone. Mm, hate the smell, but it kind of feels real, very moisturizing. It doesn't really sink into the skin very fast, but I'll try it and see if I like it or not. The second thing in here is Vichy Idealia Night Sensitive Skin. Sorry, I have to see. My phone is making me crazy. Okay, so it feels... I did sink into the skin. It took a while, but okay. So this is a Vichy Sensitive Skin aller Allergy allergy tested Vichy moisturizer thermal water recovery gel balm all skin types oh I really want to try this I do need soon a new face cream night cream so cute packaging let's open it oh it smells nice and it's pink this one I'm very excited about and the packaging is very very cute so this one looks like a good product so I'm not mad I'm I just don't like Cetaphil product but maybe I would like the body cream I don't know uh, but I don't like the face cream and the cleansing products it really don't really work for me but the Vichy products I do really like I haven't tried this one before but I'm excited to do that. Then we have a pencil. It's called Mish and Mia. Match and Mia eyeshadow 054. Uh, it's a new brand. I haven't heard about this brand before. It looks like a eyeshadow pencil. Let me see the card and read it. <coughs> Flawless fall. Okay, that sounds good. Eyeshadow chubby stick. It has a silk texture. And it does stay on and give you a beautiful, fantastic result. And it's very good to have in your purse for quick fix. Okay, so I do not think that I will ever use something like this. Okay, the phone again. And I don't think that I will use this. I will definitely put it in my giveaway, future giveaway, because a giveaway is coming soon. And then we have the Pore Professional Benefit Pro Primer. This one uh, I already have two samples of, so I will put this also in my giveaway. And then we have Liquid Jelly Blusher from Bali. Liquid Jelly Blusher. Feel, looks like a very jelly texture. 
nothing that I think I will use also. So I will put this one in my giveaway too. But I already have a lot of products in my next giveaway, guys. So there is the Benefit Professional Face Primer that goes to a giveaway. Nico Pro Liquid Jelly Blush in Bali. And it gives a nice shimmery pinky shade. Uh, so it has like a nice gold shimmer in to give you a nice glowy look and you can apply it on eyes and lips too so I will definitely put this in a, in a gloss uh, in a giveaway because I don't think that I'm going to use I have so many blushes and I know I'm definitely not going to use it and then we have Mitch Mitch and Mia eyeshadow chubby stick in a very nude nice shade and then I got the wishy sensitive skin uh, uh, wishy mineral mineralizing thermal water recovery gel balm for night time and also Cetaphil body moisturizer and it feels kind of nice so these two I will keep the rest I will put in my next giveaway but overall I think this was a good box I can't complain I think there was some beautiful products Definitely something I can see me and other people use. So yeah, I give a thumbs up to this glossy box. This one was good. Thank you so much guys for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I see you in my next video. Bye.